Guys and girls, what has been happening at the Giro this year? It's absolutely, absolutely crazy. Check out, check out this guy. Don't do it. Don't, don't touch his head. Ah, I knew it. <laughs> That's what people will do for a bottle. Here's Mark Cavendish sliding over the line for fifth place. He nearly got it there. And the Bardiani guy probably taking about five iPhone 14 Pro Maxes with him. That's quite a lot of money. Maybe like 7,000 euros down the drain right there. Uh, this is quite a lucky save. I don't think uh, you can practice a skill on the bike. So uh, let's regard it as a lucky save and not just skill. This guy nearly takes out all the spectators at the Giro 2023. Shows you how slippery the roads are. Yeah, we can see the headshot of Denezi moving across, taking Cavendish out. And um, yeah, all of the other iPhones along with it as well. Um, but this is more significant, enough of the jokes. Uh, yeah, we can see the roads are quite slippery, a crash. And uh, our big favorite, Primoz Rolik, being kept up or held up behind this crash. And this is why I still believe that they are the team to beat. Uh, I'm going to do Toluk decides, fuck this shit, I'm going to have a piss. I'm going to call it quits for the day. Gaviria, look at Rojas coming up to him. No motivation to get him back six days ago. He's also had enough of it. And eventually Gaviria gets going again, but um, to no avail, he's not going to get back with 5.5k. So yes, uh, Remco's team just pulling on the front, but the most impressive of them all are the bees from Jumbo. They actually closed that gap and brought back Primoz Roglic. Now, they, he was at Ballerini throwing away a $500 uh, Gaba, maybe a thousand dollar Gaba. I don't know what it sells for in the shop. Cut the now, keeping them at the front. Ah, oh, they're not going full, they're going pretty much as hard as they sustainably can. They haven't been waiting really for anyone. Um, it's also really tactical keeping their position. You don't want to go too hard and blow the whole team in just one kilometer. But uh, yeah, I don't know who that was. Dennis bringing back uh, Roglic finally with a massive pull. And yeah, R Remco moving over to the right-hand side as he glanced left, looking back. And he caused that crash. It's no one else's fault except his own. And there's his teammate hugging him for a team photo so we can see some sensation in the news magazines coming up this week. Oh, my teammates, I've waited for him now. Just there for the photo. I'm just just kidding. It's some sarcasm. But anyway, highlight of the day, uh, the Bardiani guy taking out four iPhone 14 Pro Maxes. Uh, I'm just happy that not too many other people got injured in this crazy final. And uh, that's all for this craziness of the Giro Stage 5 2023. And um, I hope you guys keep an eye on my channel. I'll be uploading a lot of this content. If you enjoy, leave a comment in the comment section down below. And I'll be definitely motivated to make some more of this content. That's all for today. Over and out.